balance this equation, the decomposition of lead to nitrate. Let's count the atoms up, and we need to be careful because we have a lot of different oxygen atoms over here. So first, we have one lead, and the two means we have two of these nitrate ions. So we have two times the one, two nitrogens, two times the three, six oxygens. On the product side, we have the one lead, the one nitrogen, and then oxygens, we have one plus two, that's three, plus two, three plus two, that's five. So we have five oxygens. Let's start by balancing the nitrogens and see how that works out. We could put a 2 right here in front of the NO2, and we'd have 1 times 2 for the nitrogen. That would be balanced. We need to recalculate these oxygens, though. We have the 1 plus 2 times 2 is 4 plus 2, so that gives us 7 oxygens. So we're almost balanced here. We just have a difference of 1, but we have to fix that. At this point, I think I'll double the lead to nitrate because I have fewer oxygens here than on the product side, so I'm going to have to do something. So I'm going to double it and then see how that works out. So let's update these numbers here. I have 1 times 2. Now I have 2 lead. And then for the nitrogen, I have 2 times the 1 times the 2. So essentially 2 times 2. I have 4 nitrogens. And then oxygens, I have 2 times 3. That's 6 times the 2, that's 6 times 2, that gives me 12. Okay, so that really changed things. Let's fix the lead first, because we could just put a 2 here, 1 times 2, that gives us 2 there, and that'll change the oxygens, but I also want to get the nitrogens correct, and I need to have 4 nitrogens, so I'm going to replace this here. So now, I have 1 times 4, I have 4 nitrogens. So let's update these oxygens. I have 2 times 1, that's 2, plus 4 times 2, that's 8, plus the 2 here, and 2 plus 8 is 10, plus 2 is 12, and this equation is now balanced. If you're having problems, you may have counted the oxygens incorrectly up, make sure you're counting all of them, and then just one little bit of trial and error here, 